This is my hardcore Iron Man. Without leaving PvP worlds for almost two years now, I have managed to survive multiple special attacks and multiple tail blocks on my account. I even set a bounty on my own head worth 1 billion to make this challenge harder for myself. Welcome to Hardcore Iron Man Limited to PvP Worlds. In the last Hardcore Iron Man episode, we reached 100 Zora kills and we still haven't gotten a single unique item. The item we're going for is the Tanzanite Fang. But to get there, we're gonna need four things. A lot of runes, a lot of food, a lot of prey potions and a lot of Guthix restores. I'm gonna start off by getting all the herbs I need from Chaos Druids, a very nostalgic location. I could do farming as well, but I think this is more satisfying. I can just AFK here. Oh shit! What the fuck? I'm Telblock! Oh! What? I removed the player indicator and straight away I got Telblocked. Alright, let's go bank. I'm lucky he wasn't a higher level. He can't even attack me outside of the wildy. Alright, I'm back. I should probably stop watching Prison Break and actually focus on the screen. What's going on? Two people here. That's so... Are they scouts? Okay, he's back. <laughs> he dropped weed. Alright, thanks for the weed, I guess. These are going to be the last herbs to get. 100 Rainers, I think this is gonna be enough for f at least 50 Zora kills. Oh shit, we're tell block. Don't get an entangle, don't get an entangle. He splashed! He splashed! Oh my god! Dude, this player indicator... What the f Fuck. First of all, I removed the player indicator because it got too easy. Look at that. Kinda, it, it kinda pops in the face. So I've decided I will keep the player indicator plugin off until I do something very, very risky, something like God Wars Dungeon, for example, or Deep Wilderness and things. I found a very efficient way to make Gothic's restores in PvP worlds. You just boil water, which you get from the fountain. You use the bowl of hot water into the empty cup. Then you add a Marantil to each cup, then a Haralander. Then finally two Guams to every single cup. And voila, you got yourself your Gothic's restores. Sixth one Herblor. A few moments later, we made 100 Prayer Potions and 87 Gothic's restores. Let's go. Now we're gonna need a lot of food. I'm going with Lydio for his cheese potatoes. There's a guy over there. Oh, oh my god. He's in Max. Ah, ah. Shit just got serious. Yeah, they are, they are legit everywhere. <laughs> who, who are these? I've never seen these names before. Let's go Glade. Good, I'm free. There's a level 3 scout. So I'm not free. Can this man stop finding me? He knows my every location. How does he do it? We have everything we need now except for the runes. Blood runes and death runes very expensive. We need money to buy it and we have no money as well. I'm gonna grab myself a slayer task. Korask. We're gonna do that one. I really hope we can finish this task without being disturbed at all. Oh. Oh. Nah, I, I, I CBA, man. I. That's my third kill! I'm not gonna let you tank test me. I, I don't care. I'm not letting you tank test me, Juelo. Not three, not four, not ten. I killed two Korask. Just look at that. I killed two Korask. Do you guys remember this graph? More consistent uploads equals to more people hunting me. And we have now reached a point where the hardcore Iron Man is unplayable. We get zero progress. All right, I took a two hour break. I can now play actually. And we got 100K from Cyclops. Thank you very much. So even though I enjoy Cyclops, Skeletal Wyvern is the way to go for fast cash. Look at that, the first drop, granite legs. I'm not sure this guy looks like a dragon killer, but it could very likely be a, you know, a scout. We were pretty unlucky with the high alt drops. We only got 82k cash. Oh, you saw that stink cock was right there under Steve. So I've been scouted officially. This was a good trip. We made 95k cash. For the first time ever on this account, I'm creating super stores. This is going to be the key potion for the inferno. Look at this beautiful stack of 60 
superstores. Mm. Skeletal wyverns have been very disappointing today. Only 25k cash. Oh, this is a good trip. We made 61k so far and now we get another rune kite shield. We got a level 97 here and we the trip is done. This was the best trip so far. 890k cash and a lot of supplies. I think it's time to do some Zora. Pretty please, no one be at the teleport spot. Thank you very much. Here we go. Good. First kill of the episode. For absolutely nothing. Yes, we got the Manta Rays. Beautiful. Dude, what's this guy doing here? Iron eat ass? I don't think so, mister. Dead! We killed this Iron Man. You okay? Yes, I'm very okay. I, I, I just assumed this guy was a scout. That's why I killed him. Almost out of food again. And we get snapdragons and scales. For more Manta Rays. Beautiful. For Chaos Runes. And we got Zora Teleport. Nice. Okay, that's the final kill. Now we're out of runes. For more Zora teleports. Oh my god, I'm so happy right now. His name is not my scout, so he can't be a scout. And we are back to the beautiful Skeletal Wyverns for more cash. First trip back to Skeletal Wyverns. Actually a good trip. 112k cash. Is this a scout? Oh my god, there's a fight going on. <gasps> Smited? Oh my god, someone died. If he killed me, that would have been one bill, but he killed the other guy. Such a stupid PK, he didn't kill me for one bill. Second trip wasn't too good, 31k cash. I need to make money quick, so I'm using all my rubies for high ox. Okay, we have now bought ourselves 1k blood and death runes. We are now ready for Zora. Hey, another kill. Battle staffs and cooking experience. Okay, I don't have a recoil and I almost died. Every time I forget a recoil, I almost die. Shit, bro. It's so early in the morning, I'm so tired. Antidotes. And we get law runes. We get more battle staffs and cooking experience. It's now, oh my god, we were out of food. That was so bad. For the dragon metal, no. That's the final kill. Now we're out of death runes. And we get more death runes. Nice. We can do one more kill. We get manta rays as our final kill. Ooh, new PB. 211. That could have ended so badly. 1000 chaos runes. And that's the final kill. We are still dry. 115 kill count into Zora. The moment no one but me have been waiting for. 97. Magic. And we are back for Korask and Slayer XP. The moment everyone but me have been waiting for. 97 range. And that is the task completed. I have really underestimated how good Korask are. 317k cash from 167 kills. And from our weekly tiers of good eggs, we get one runecrafting level. And that's 65 prayer. We are back to Zora. First kill back for grapes. Cooking experience for more grapes. More cooking experience. Death runes, that's good. For Zolra teleports, I love you. Death runes. Another kill for absolutely nothing predicted. Ooh, Zolra teleport, yes. Ooh, a lot of grapes. We're getting 99 cooking today. Yep, that's, that's where we're going. Oh ho, hello. You coming in salads robes, huh? 125 kill count without a single drop. And we are officially out of blood runes. And we get antidotes for our final kill. Thanks to Zolra, I managed to get myself 77, 78 cooking. And we are back to Skeletal Wyvern. This was a great trip, 188k cash from Skeletal Wyverns and plenty of supplies. Another wyvern strip for 112k, 750k in total. Got myself a black dragon task, might as well just complete it real quickly. And that's the task completed. Another very disappointing trip to wyverns. Only 56k cash this time. We are back, baby. We are back. Oh my god, nothing. Pure essence. Was that a scout? Death runes, thank you. For more Zolder teleports, we were just out. Four Chaos Runes. We got a lot of Zora skills this time. Zora teleports. Dead. And that's the final kill. No Blood Runes left. And it was another day without a single unique item. The grind continues. I just realized I do have an Elite Clue Scroll. We're gonna see if we can complete this bad boy. Completed. Completed. Comprebe. Subscribe. 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 This gotta be the casket. We got a casket. We got an Elite 
casket. This doesn't happen too often. The two things I hope I get, Dragonstone Necklace and Dragonstone Bracelet for the teleports here in 3, 2, 1. Boom! We got it. Ooh, construction experience and high out. This is a great clue scroll. Very good. I'm very happy with this one. No freaking way. Do I really need to complete Legends Guild to charge this skills necklace? That's something I will have to do in a future episode, but for now, I'll just keep it in the bank. Back to my favorite dragon. Woohoo! From the first trip back, 159k cash. Level 91 is here. This man died. Own bone just died. Why are there so many people here today? A pretty good trip actually, 110k cash. So apparently I can sell these chaos runes for cash. Seven, eight, nah it's not worth it anymore. It's a hardcore Iron Man. I love the adrenaline, ooh he's like me. All right, I haven't done this the entire video. Shamans. Oh, hello. Hope he dies. Oh my, he almost died. And we are out. Good, we got nothing. This trip was amazing. 40 kills of shamans, 215k cash. Back to Solra, one final time. If we don't get anything, we don't get anything. Dead! First kill back for absolutely nothing. Cooking experience, thank you. For nothing. Yep, I knew, I knew it he was waiting for me. I saw him gearing up, he scouted me. Silver ore, that's the first. The, this guy is still here. He must be a scout dude. He's been there twice now. Hey, another kill. For you, logs. Battle staffs and nature rune. For dragon bones. 140 kill count. I don't know if you guys remember this, but uh, I'm getting flashbacks from when I was 150 barrel chest without a single unique. We are almost reaching the same kill count on Zora. Uh, but yeah, that was the final kill. We are out of runes. Back to making money. Maybe it's a good thing Jags are considering to remove PvP worlds because then I don't ever have to go dry ever again. Because I don't have to play this shitty account. Lag, Jagex. The servers aren't too good right now. I should probably leave. Loot from Shamans, 6 to 1k. And we got a hard and elite clue scroll. Step 1, completed. Step 2, completed. Step 3, completed. Step 4, completed for the hard casket. Before we open this one, we're gonna try to complete the elite one as well. Step 1 of the elite, completed. Step 2, completed. Step 3 is very risky. I have to kill an Aviancy. And the only place to kill one is in God Wars dungeon. A lot of clans go there. Alright, we are going to do this clue task, but player indicator will be on. There is the cave. Still no white dot, good. Give me the echo key, clue elite. Thank you very much. Let's get out of here. <sighs> Hello, Miss Old Crone. And we get another clue scroll. Oh, we gotta go to the King Black Dragon now. Oh my god. Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I got into this situation. It's photoshopped. Good, no one's here. Let's go, real quick. And it's gonna be dead now. Beautiful, let's get the clue and get out of here. And, yes, we got a casket. Let's start off with a hard clue scroll. Yes! I've been dropping a clue scroll which requires this shield so long. Uh, now I finally got this shield. Beautiful clue scroll. And we got an elite as well. Okay, this was just trash. At least we can high out these items. Another trip to Shaman's done. 195k cash. Oh fuck. Oh no. Oh no. It's over guys. I need a bug. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I can't do the run for it. No, 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 there's two of them.
Oh my god! Hell yes! Oh my god! Oh, oh I'm shaking! Oh, that was the death! Oh my god! Oh my god, we did it! Holy shit! Oh my god! Ah, oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, we can't continue like this. Oh, he's very, 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 very smart. These are the people who have been hunting me the entire week and knowing how crazy they are, they are probably logged in on every single world where I logged out. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to wait for my membership to end, which is in two days, and then I'll respawn in Lumbridge. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you very soon. Before we end, I just want to let you know that new episodes of PvP but Hardcore Iron Man is based on likes and new subscribers. So if we get a lot of likes and new subscribers, there will be a lot of new episodes. Mm -hmm.